Why are you keeping your eyes open? It's so I'm not. I'm <laughs> squinting like crazy. Are you? Yeah, me too. Hey, this is Amir. This is Diana. And you're watching Vegan Tucson. Welcome back to our channel. If you're interested in vegan food and all other vegan things, you're in the right place. Sit back, relax, grab yourself some dim sum, and enjoy this episode. We have new episodes every Sunday. All I gotta say is, can you Dig it, suckers! Get it? I did. Warrior. We're in Coney Island, which means one thing, because we're in New York. So, forget about it. I'm walking here! Capiche? That's all I got. That was a good force where we had to. Today we had lunch at Spicy Moon. They have two locations. We went to the one in West Village. It looks very residential. It was very busy, so I don't know where these people came from. There must be businesses nearby, and that's why there was a lunch crowd. It looked cute. Amir said the neighborhood looked quaint, so yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh no, first time I've been there. And that's not a term I use often. Interior, what do you think? Spicy Moon is like a Chinese restaurant when I looked online, so I didn't expect the exterior to be so bright and cutesy. The interior, we sat near the front. I think you said there were more tables in the back. Yeah, there I was, couldn't yeah. see it when I came in, but we sat near the front and there was like a bar as well. I think it was closed when we first got there and as we were leaving, they turned the lights on and they were setting it up. Let's talk about the food we got. We got the lunch special. What did you get? So the lunch special, each person can order a starter and a main dish. So for my starter, I got the steamed dumplings. And for my main dish, I got the dan dan noodles. For my starter, I got the fried dumplings. And for my main dish, I got mao pao tofu. Let's start with the dumplings. Let's start with yours first. What do you think? There are only two, so the serving is actually quite small for the lunch special. But the dumplings themselves were really stuffed with good ingredients. And it came with a dipping sauce that was like soy and vinegar, I think. I really enjoyed the dumplings. The pan fried ones that Amir had weren't that different from the steamed ones because they weren't super fried. What did you think? I agree. I thought they were very similar, but they were, as Diana said, the portions were really small. But the dumplings themselves are quite big. Mm -hmm. And they were nice and firm. The dumplings normally falls apart when you take a bite. These didn't. It was nice and firm. You could take a nice bite. The dough was a little bit chewy, which I thought made it really good. The sauce was really good. Overall, enjoyed it greatly. Should we do it? Yeah. One, two, two three. three. I like noodles and I had read online that a lot of people recommended the Dan Dan noodles so I thought I'd order it and it was so good. It's very simple. It's really noodles with some green onions and some mustard greens but the sauce is so so good. It's like a rich peanutty based sauce. It wasn't spicy. I don't think it was spicy but there was a lot of flavor that made it so good. I 100% agree with you again. I think it was very flavorful. The noodles were nicely cooked, so they weren't too doughy, too hard, too soft. The mustard green was really good. It was almost like a fake meat substitute, which it's not, obviously, but it was really good. It went really well with it. The sauce was awesome. Very good dish. Probably? Yeah. One, One two, two, three. Boom, fine. If you're a regular to this channel, you know that mao pao tofu is one of my favorite Chinese dishes and this one did not disappoint. It was really good, really spicy. The tofus were nicely cooked, not too soft, not too hard. The sauce was really good, really well done. What do you think? I really liked it too. The sauce was a little bit spicy but not too spicy and you could taste the peppercorn in it. And 
It doesn't come with rice, so we ordered a side of rice for the dish. And it was really good. The portion size was enough for the two of us, I thought, for lunch. I would also recommend the mapo tofu. One, two, three. Oh, would you ever go back to Spicy Moon and dine again? I would. It's early in our trip. We haven't eaten at many restaurants yet, but this one was so good. The food is pretty simple. I feel like right. it's kind of like home cooked style food, right. but it's so, so good. The price I thought was fair and yeah, it was delicious. I really enjoyed it. Well, I'll be honest, when I first walked in there and I saw the decor and I saw, you know, a Caucasian young lady working there, I was like, oh, this is gonna be bonkers. This is not gonna be any good at all. But I was wrong, man. I was wrong. It was off the hook. It was really, really good. I enjoyed it very much. And yes, I would absolutely go back again. And you know what? That's what we think. But you guys go try that yourself. And as always, let us know what you think. Okay, Boppers, that's it. That's the show. If you enjoyed this episode and you like the kind of shows we do, if it brings you any kind of value, do us a favor, press that subscribe button. Give it a thumbs up. And ring that bell so you won't miss any episodes. We would appreciate that very much. Thank you. Take a look at this episode on Amir's lovely face. You'll enjoy it as well. Thanks for watching, Boppers. Thank you for watching. Boppers. Boppers. Thank <laughs> you.